So this is a quick video on how to check if the aperture diaphragm of a lens is good. And this should be mandatory watching for everybody who sells lenses on eBay because seems to work fine is often complete rubbish. So here's how a camera works. When you're looking through the viewfinder, the camera is wide open. The lens is wide open so that you get as much light to uh, frame that shot. So when you uh, press the shutter, the aperture closes down to whatever you have set or whatever the camera has decided should be set for the shot. So the problem is, say it has to close all the way down to that tiny little hole. Um, and say the shutter is open for a thousandth of a second. That means the camera goes close down, take, show, take the photo, open up again. If there's any delay in that closing down, then you're going to get too much light. Uh, and that usually happens when oil gets on either the front or the rear of the diaphragm. So how do you test it? Really, really easy. Get a digital camera. Set it to aperture priority. Set the aperture to, let's start off large, so that for this is the largest hole is wide open is f1.8. Let's just put this in live preview mode so that you can see. So we're going to take a photo of this with f1.8. And you can see that is well exposed. Put that to focus. Now we're going to switch to the highest f-stop at this point, which in this case is f22. We're going to take the same photo. And now, when we look at those two photos, they should be exactly the same brightness. You get the difference in depth of field. There's the wide open shot, f1.8. There's the f2.22. But they are exactly the same exposure, which means that aperture is closing down exactly how it should. This lens is good. I'll buy it. Bye.